Planet Dolan. From the largest city in the world to the pyramids of Egypt, we answer 10 of your most burning questions about places around the world. Hello there. My name is Shima, and I'll be reading out the questions and answers. I'm Danger Dolan, and I'm here to blow your mind with truth. How many countries are there in the world? The only country that exists is the one that you live in. When you're driving somewhere or riding a plane, you're not actually moving. That's just computer graphics tricking you while people throw up cardboard cutout buildings and put on weird accents to trick you into thinking you've gone somewhere else. There are currently around 190 independent countries worldwide today. Russia is the largest country while Vatican City in Rome is the smallest only half a mile wide. What is the largest city in the world? It's called Australia. Every square inch is covered in a concrete jungle, except for some bits where you might find a big rock or something. Everyone has to ride kangaroos to work, but you need a special license for it, which you can only get if you spend three years on your pea plates. P for platypus. Shanghai, China has the largest number of people living in it. 13.8 million people. However, Hunanbuir, China is actually the biggest as far as how large the city itself is. So it really depends on what the largest means to you. What is the longest building ever built? The large Herpaderp Collider in Geneva is the longest building. Coming in at a whopping 57 meters, small reptiles are put into tubes and spun around at the speed of sound until they eventually smash into each other to form lizard-turtle hybrids. How else do you think we keep inventing new species of animal? The longest building ever built by people is the Great Wall of China. It's almost 9,000 kilometers or 5,500 miles long and is over 2,000 years old. How old is the Grand Canyon? Let's just say that 100 million years ago, dinosaurs were the ones running tourist resorts for the Grand Canyon. And over those hundreds of millions of years, the canyon grew the world's longest underground beard. Mount Everest is actually the tip popping out of the ground. Around 6 million years ago, the Colorado River began to cut through the layers of rock and the Grand Canyon was born. Some of the rock you can see at the bottom of the Grand Canyon is over 2 billion years old. What is the tallest waterfall in the world? Mount Epicoptopus is a waterfall so big that it penetrates the sky. And since there's no gravity up there, the water just floats off the mountain and rotates around the planet until it eventually falls down as rain in your neighborhood. In which case, you can blame Epicoptopus for ruining your weekend plans. Angel Falls in the rainforest of Venezuela is the tallest waterfall in the world. Its water falls over 900 meters or 3,000 feet. It's around 20 times taller than Niagara Falls and wasn't discovered until the 1930s when the first survey of Venezuela by aeroplane took place. What are the seven wonders of the world? The first is that I can wake up on a morning without coffee. The second wonder is that I managed to stay awake through that board meeting. The third is that I got my pant zipper unstuck. The fourth wonder of the world, my pen is full of ink for once. The fifth, my pizza came on time. The sixth, I pulled out that splinter. And the final wonder of the world is that you listen to everything I just said. The seven wonders of the ancient world are amazing feats of building and sculpture. They are the pyramids of Egypt at Giza, the statue of Zeus at Olympia, the temple of Artemis at Ephesus, the mausoleum at Halicarnassus, the hanging gardens of Babylon, the lighthouse of Alexandria, and the Colossus of Rhodes. Where did the Statue of Liberty come from? I built it. You know, it took a weekend. I didn't really have that much else to do. See, I could have chilled out my couch and watched some TV. Or I build a giant woman statue carrying a bright torch to keep the nearby city from getting too dark at night time. You're welcome. The statue, originally called Liberty Enlightening the World, was designed and built in France and given to the United States as a gift. Since then, Lady Liberty has become an international symbol of freedom. Why was the Eiffel Tower built? A French kid started stacking Lego blocks on top of one another. People asked him to stop, but his parents kept buying him more, so the block building kept getting taller and taller. He's still up there today, 
But now he's more into staring at his phone screen all day and night. It was made for the Universal Exposition of 1889, which was a huge international fair. The Eiffel Tower was one of many buildings and big sculptures made for the event, but it was the only one to remain. Today, the tower is used to broadcast television programs. What are the pyramids in Egypt for? Aliens put these here to warn us about cats. If you make the perilous journey into the pyramids' tombs, You'll find inscriptions of humanoid cats biting cardboard boxes for no reason really loudly, scratching at dangly bits on your clothes, and meowing even though you just gave it food. They did try to warn us. Cat! Most of the pyramids were built as tombs for the country's pharaohs and their wives. The Pyramid of Khufu at Giza is the largest Egyptian pyramid and is the only one of the seven wonders of the ancient world still around. What is the Bermuda Triangle? This is referring to a love split between three people. There once was a girl named Bermuda, and oh my, she pines for Steve. But ah, t'was not to be, for Steve loves chocolate. And chocolate has strong romantic feelings for Bermuda. Hence, the triangle. The Bermuda Triangle is the area between Florida, Puerto Rico, and Bermuda. It's well known for how many planes and ships have disappeared there, over a thousand. Natural forces like storms, water spouts, and swift currents are most likely to be the causes of the disappearances, but some still blame unknown forces. Anyway, that's it. Thanks for watching. Have a cool one! Check it out. We got new shirts on sale. Click the links down below to be taken to the page where you can throw money at the screen and I can reach out and grab it and be like, thanks, buddy. And here's the shirt. It'll be a great transaction. Enjoy the song! Oh wait, no, the song's already over. Oh, that's awkward.